Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today we follow Katie Kidman, or as she likes to be called, Betty Buttcrack, as she gets thrown out of a courthouse for the second time in one day. So, sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. They have, they know how to turn your cameras off in here. The minute I walk into the police station or city hall, the camera goes off. I went over here into the courthouse and the camera shut off so I didn't get the footage of the guy that just manhandled me and threw me out of the courthouse over here. So I have to go back over here with my camera and tell them I need his name. So... I'm going over here to get it. They're not going to bully me. He just ripped my arm out of the socket. Miss Betty Buttcrack, if your injuries were really that severe, you would make haste to the nearest hospital right away to get yourself checked out and form a possible lawsuit if that was truly the case. Threw me out of the courthouse, physically threw me out, and then had to go back and get my backpack and my stuff to give to me. So I could leave. These people are sick. <laughs> Completely sick in the head. I'm telling you. Have any of you been in the jail here? Excuse me? Have you been in the jail? You should go have a look at it. They put me in there for walking down a public sidewalk. Now, where's the tyrant that just manhandled me? Can you give me his name? Surely you can't be serious about calling him a tyrant. I mean, you're just one generation removed from those who actually fought in the war. And they witnessed firsthand what true tyranny is. I don't believe he manhandled you. Yes, he did. He grabbed me. He took, he tore my arm out of the socket physically threw me out of the courtroom, and I need to FOIA request his body camera or any kind of cameras you have in here. Ma'am, can I get a FOIA request? Or his name? You guys are sick. You're working for a bunch of tyrants and you're gonna sit there quietly and act like you don't do anything or know anything. That's why they're doing this. Don't you get it? That's why they can arrest a 62-year-old grandma for walking down a public street. You guys are gonna get sued. You are not even gonna have a job. Oh, I'm so scared. That jail over there is rusted. It has dried black blood dripping off the ceiling. Here he comes. That's him. I need your name. Come on out. Come on out, Tyrant. I need your name, Bellinger. Yeah, you have my name. You want to, No, You're I didn't. The camera went off. Yes, I can. You're more than welcome. The, to come here can. Can. the First to Amendment to right like gives me. You manhandled me and ripped my arm out of the socket. Right. Right over there and threw me physically out of the courtroom. But you're not allowed to record inside the court. Yes, I can. Okay. No, Miss Betty Buttcrack. It is the judge that makes the call on who can fill in the courtroom. It is not a traditional public forum. In fact, it is a non-public forum. All right, I already told It's you a public the building. Are. The rules are okay. the First Amendment. All right. Have freedom nice of day. press, freedom of speech, freedom of religion, freedom to redress your government. Have you been into that nasty jail over there? Can I lock the door? I gotta get my pin. Okay. Can I lock the door? Okay. I'll lock it. Lock the door? Yeah, lock the door. You know what, lady? Okay. You guys have no idea what they just did to me yes, over here. Step outside. They transferred me. Step outside. They transferred me to Santa Barbara. Okay, step outside. And threw me across the back of a van. Okay, okay step outside. I'm a disabled grandmother. Okay, step outside. Why do you please. guys, this is America. Okay. Why are you acting like this? You're allowed to come in, but why? you're not allowed to record stats. I want to know why people I just of my you. own race and my own country why? are treating me like this and acting like this to our people. 
What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. At no point in your rambling, incoherent response were you even close to anything that could be considered a rational thought. Everyone in this room is now dumber for having listened to it. God have mercy on your soul. Why? Why are you? Let the door close. Why? You're like my dad. Let the door close. I don't please. understand how you can lock me in a jail. Let the door close. Please. In a rusty, bloody old okay. jail. Step back, please. And leave me in there. Okay. How could you do that? Okay. You're allowed to come in and How take could you do that to me? To court, court staff. How could you That's do that to anyone? Okay. All right, you're not allowed to come in. How could you? Tell me why. Why would you do that to me? You hurt me so bad doing that to me. So bad. It's a rusty old jail over there with dry blood all over the bunk beds and everything. How could you work for people like that? Shame on you all. Shame on you. Shame on them. All right. Let's watch that again, and everybody leave a rating of 1 to 5 in the comments as far as her performance goes. 1 being horrible, and 5 being stupendous. Why? Okay. Why are you? Let the door close. Why? You're like my dad. Okay. Let the door close. I don't understand how you can lock okay. me in a jail. Let the door close. Please. In a rusty, bloody old okay. jail. Step back, please. And leave me in there. Okay. How could you do that? Okay. You're allowed to come in and How take could you do that to me? To court, court staff. How could you Absolutely. do that to anyone? Okay. All right, you're not allowed to come in. How could you? Tell me why. Why would you do that to me? You hurt me so bad doing that to me. So bad. It's a rusty old jail over there with dry blood all over the bunk beds and everything. How could you work for people like that? Shame on you all! Shame on you! Well, I certainly wasn't fooled by that performance one bit, so I'm going to do what we call in the education field a gift C. So she's going to get a C out of me, so that would be a 3 out of 5. She deserves more of a 2.